So, when last we left our heroes, Hector and Paris had just gotten back out onto the battlefield to keep fighting. And they keep fighting, but only for a little while, because then the gods decide that they all really want to go to sleep, and so they inspire Hector to go try and challenge one of the Greeks to a duel. And Menelaus is like, well, apparently I accept all duels ever, so I'll do it. And Nestor's like, no, dude, he'll totally murder you. Get our resident giant, Big Ajax, to do it. And Big Ajax is like, yeah. So they get out there, and they start fighting. Throws a spear, throw another spear, going at it with swords, and then the gods are like, okay, guys, we're really tired. It's way past our bedtime. Can you just you go to sleep? So then, for some reason, Hector and Ajax decide that they're BFF, and they go back to their camps, and then both camps simultaneously decide that they need an extra day after that to bury all of their dead, like pansies. But then, the day after that, the fight starts up again, and Zeus starts it off by raining lightning on the Greeks. Just non-stop chain lightning through their faces. <laughs> which is made even worse by the fact that Hector is charging at them. So Agamemnon gets up on a rock and gives a really great resounding speech to all of his troops, and one of their archers, Teucer, just like shooting the shit out of all of these Trojans all over the place, left and right, left and right. But they're still doing really shitty. So then Hera and Athena are like, Zeus, can we please go down there and help our favorite people, the Greeks? And Zeus is like, tough tits, bitches. I'm the only one allowed to interfere in this fight. And I'm not going to help the Greeks. Because I got a blowjob from Achilles' mom, Thetis, on the account that I'd be spiteful forever. So I'm going to do that. So he continues to do that. And he says that the only chance that the Greeks have is if they get Achilles to help them. So the Greeks decided they need to get Achilles to help them. So they send a whole bunch of presents over to his tent, and they send all their greatest heroes, Odysseus and Big Ajax, and also Little Ajax, and also Nestor, and also Diomedes. They all go over to the tent, and they're like, Achilles, look, there's a ton of fat loot right here. Please re rejoin the fight. And Achilles is like, nah, I think I'm going to go back to my home country and join a band or something maybe get a little bit of coke start dealing coke and they're like dude come on we're all gonna die because you're being a little pansy and achilles is like well that's not a good way to get me to join you guys just get out of here so they get out of there and they go back to their tents unsuccessful knowing that they're completely boned but after that they decide to do a little bit of a night raid so Diomedes and Odysseus go out to try and scout out and find exactly how boned they are. And, as luck would have it, in the middle of the night, when they're skulking around, they find a Trojan who's trying to do the same thing. And they grab him and they're like, tell us everything about your lines. And he's like, don't kill me, I'll tell you. And he tells them. And then they kill him. And they take all of his stuff. And then they use the information they got to go to the least defended camp, which is the camp of the Thracians, who just arrived, like, yesterday. And they're all sleeping. And so they butcher them in the sleep. Now imagine this. Like, there's a war that's been going on for nine years and people keep telling you dude you should go check out the trojan war it's pretty sweet you should go defend troy and you're like i don't know and finally you get your shit together and you decide nine years after the fact to go show up to the war and the first day you're there you get murdered by two guys showing up in your camp who then steal your chariot and ride back to their camp and get patted on the back by everybody there diomedes is seriously the mvp for the fucking greeks in the iliad so, anyway, next day, fight starts up again. And Zeus starts this one off by raining blood on the Greeks. As if lightning was not enough. I mean, lightning is actually more deadly than blood. So I guess they were actually probably pretty happy that it was blood and not lightning that day. But regardless, it's a shitty way to wake up in the morning. So Hector is like, okay, I'm going to press the fuck out of this charge and kill all the Greeks right now. And Zeus is like, no, just wait a couple of minutes. Agamemnon will get injured and it'll be way better. So then Agamemnon gets injured. Then Hector presses the charge. Then Diomedes hits Hector in the head with a spear. Like I said, MVP. Then Paris actually gets his balls up and shoots an arrow at Diomedes, taking him out of the fight. And then Odysseus goes down because he's completely surrounded by dudes. And he takes down like 50, but he still goes down. And then Big Ajax carries him off the field. So they're going back and forth and back and forth. And the Greeks are doing all right for themselves, actually. I guess because they're not being hit by fucking lightning today. But then their healer goes down. And he gets carried back into camp and everyone is like, Oh shit, what the fuck are we going to do now? And Nestor goes and grabs Achilles' boy toy, Patroclus. And is like, Patroclus, dude, I need you to go and get your butt buddy to 
put on his armor and get back out onto the field. And if you can't do that, then I want you to put on his armor and go out so at least everybody thinks Achilles is there so that we can feel good about ourselves while we're getting murdered by the Trojans. Because right now we just kind of feel like shit. And Patroclus is like, I'll see what I can do. And that is a story for another time.